Hey guys, Luke C here for TFB TV. We're back here on the SHOT Show 2024 floor. I'm here with Thaddeus from Palmetto State Army looking at some of their new shotguns. Thaddeus, what can you tell me about these brand new shotguns? So this is the Palmetto State Armory 570, which is meant to be your build-it-yourself shotgun, build your own series. We'll sell in complete firearms and part kits. It's been designed from the bottom up to be user-friendly, and modular so that you can configure it how you want your gun to be. Um, you know, starting off, uh, all of them will be optics cut, uh, top tang safety, and you have an axe release in the high ready position. You've got dual extractors, a beveled loading port area, and every one of these, um, these are 870 furniture compatible, um, so you can configure it how you want. Uh, a lot of options out there already. Uh, once you start to get to the front side of the gun is where things really become new and novel. Um, our lockup system actually happens in the back, not in the front. So your hanger, you can move where you want as you see fit between different barrel lengths and mag tube, magazine okay. tube capacities. Uh, the barrel length does not dictate what tube you have to use. Um, so once you, you can take this nut off and you can swap it out, it's easy for a customer to do um, and they can configure whatever magazine tube they, length that they want without having to be a gunsmith. Um, you move this, you move the hanger around, uh, you can take it off. This uses um, pistol optics, um, so you can take your favorite dagger optic that you use, favorite Glock optic, and you can put it on your shotgun. Um, really provide a playground that people can have a shotgun that they can make truly theirs. Right, and this, this has been something that Palmetto State Army has always been really good at, getting people parts for their builds at a at a good price. Absolutely. And so you're talking, like, we're, we're getting standalone receivers, right? Correct. Okay. Yeah, we will sell standalone components. You'll sell this complete firearm, or you can buy this in pieces and you can put it together. Um, we designed it from the ground up to be friendly to assemble, to be a friendly to build. Um, you know, if you're mechanically climbed just to the little little ascents, you can follow a video and you can build this gun at home, no problem. I'm assuming you guys are going to have a build video up on your absolutely. On your awesome. uh, as you know, the, as the weeks go on, following shot show, we'll announce more videos and you know bring people up to date on how the polling's going, um, what you know what we'll be working on um, more in depthly, what we're prioritizing really, um, and get the details of this gun. Do a field trip, show how easy it is. Um, and that really is a build-it-yourself type of thing, um, or you can reconfigure quite easily at home. Yeah, and you also mentioned, uh, you know, this being a do-it-yourself, a build-your-own kit, uh, there's no proprietary tools except for one that you guys yeah, provide. Yeah, so that would be the wrench, um, which is just due to size constraints the magazine tube. Uh, it's just a simple component uh, that you can use to tighten and loosen your magazine tube. It'll be provided with the gun. Um, everything else is just standard tooling. Yeah, punches um, and, and screwdrivers. Yep. Yeah, so just a punch, you can take out the sugar housing group and you can field strip this entire, uh, the guts of the firearm uh, without having to take your stock or forearm off. You don't have to take your barrel off to, to field strip this gun. Okay, and the, the optics cut, what pattern is that for? So this is an RMR cut, um, and it, that's gonna be standard. It's not a premium offering, that is standard on all 570 okay. shots. And it obviously will come with a, an optics cover an, plate. An if optics you cover run, plate. If you included. want to do standard iron sights. Okay. Correct. Yeah, and that'll uh, be a, a rear sight. Um, so the irons will be built straight into that plate. Okay. And uh, is there a possibility for any adapter plates? Uh, there's always possibilities, right? It's a concept gun. Uh, we haven't flushed out what that launch um, options will be, uh, but this is Palmetto State Armory at the end of the day. Um, we love to give people options. Right, um, and so people, if people want this to happen for sure, What's the best way that they can do that? They can go the onto the Armory. website and they can go in there and they vote on all the concepts of guns that we have at show. Um, it's not saying that we're not going to do any of them, but it just helps us prioritize what the people want. Which one they which want is first. Key. Um, we're trying to en engage more. There's a lot of a lot of new stuff here. There's a lot of cool stuff and here. You guys have. It's, I mean, we're never going to get out of the PSA booth. Like last year, we were here for three days. We're probably going to be here all week. So yeah, I mean, there's 15 <laughs> concepts that are here at the booth. Um, this is just one one of those concepts so a lot of cool stuff coming if you had to guess and just throw a number out there and we won't hold you to it roughly how much do you think i'd have to pay for just a receiver you know concept wise um it's hard to say all right we're not trying to give any price points or any deliverables on the concepts mm -hmm. until you know we get those voting we start to dedicate um substantial resources to how we prioritize um but it'll be quite affordable um 
I just you know point you towards how we do it with our other products. Mm -hmm. uh, and you'll get a good idea of you know pricing and how we would offer options. Awesome. Uh, you know, consistent with what Paul Meadow State Armory is. We're trying to take that build it your own, um, you know, and bring it across the boards places it's never been before. Yeah, and you also mentioned uh, when the shotgun does launch, you're, you guys are going to have the full suite of parts and components so that you can not only build out the shotgun, but if something breaks, like your, your uh, ejector here, you can buy that and yeah, replace it at home yourself. It's fully serviceable. Um, you don't need to go to a gunsmith to replace anything. Um, once you start to learn how to build the gun, go through his videos, you realize that it's extremely easy to replace any components should you break something or should something happen. It's very easy to service this gun. We will fully support all components with it. You can build it, you can buy it. Yeah. And uh, one last question. We, we got this shotgun right here. The one behind us has a, a suppressor mounted in front yep. of it. Is the threaded barrel going to be a standard configuration thing? So or is that we will just have barrel options? standard cylinder bore options and we will have uh, threaded barrels as well. Um, just consistent with the Palmetto State Armory way, um, with how easy it is to swap out these components, you can configure it how you want. There'll be both options out there. Right on. Well, I mean, it sucks we, we don't know when it's going to come out or how much it's going to cost, but um, guys, stay tuned to TFB TV and TFB TV Showtime so we can bully Palmetto State Armory into giving us more of these great, awesome, cool products that we're seeing here. So stay tuned to the show. We'll bring you more from the SHOT Show room floor.